Hey everyone! In this video, I'm going to be unboxing a package that I got from Kid Robot. So, if you didn't know, Kid Robot specializes in um, different figurines as well as known for their mystery figurines or mystery boxes that they have. You probably have seen a couple of them maybe at Hot Topic or you've seen them at, I think, Box Lunch, Target. Um, it usually says Kid Robot on them. They're most known for their Labbit series. So they're like rabbits and they're um, dressed differently, whether in carnival status or Halloween or other themes that I can't think of because I'm super excited to already get this box because I ordered it on Cyber Monday, I believe. And um, they had different bundles. So I think it was 50 75 100 and then there was one that was like 500 and they guaranteed double of the value that you paid for but they also had something called naughty or nice and i'm not too certain what that really means but i know for the most part um you might be slipped some extra items that were super exclusive to um kid robot or um, no longer are being sold by Kid Robot, and that the grand prize was a labbit stool, so I'm assuming that's like a chair <laughs> or something of sorts. But yeah, I actually bought the $100 one because I've been meaning to buy a bunch of stuff from Kid Robot, but it got really pricey, especially for certain sets that I wanted, where I wanted to at least have the highest chance of getting the whole set by buying a whole box. So I think it was... Maybe a pe like something that was 24 pieces um, within the box would turn out to be 240 to like $300. So I could not invest in that at the moment or back then as well. So it was a great opportunity to actually be able to buy a mystery box and be able to invest in this company because I do like a bunch of their mystery figurines. I do have a couple that I got from Hot Topic that went on sale that were Halloween um, related. So I'm really excited to open this box. It is way bigger than I expected. I did buy, I'm not sure if I mentioned it, um, the $100 box. So this is me. This is the box. This box is gigantic and it has some weight to it. So it, oh, so on the side of the box, I didn't realize it, it says, you made the nice list. So I'm assuming that I might get some extra stuff, I think. And it says, they say nice guys finish last, but not today. Happy whatever. Kid Robot Christmas Elves. Share what you got with the hashtag Christmas time. And that's Christmas time with a K for a K, Kid Robot. So yeah, okay, cool. So that's how you know if you're on the naughty or nice list. So I'm hoping um, nice means I got extra stuff. So this might be a long video because of course, if there's mystery items in here, I wanna open them and reveal what's inside. But I guess it depends on how much items are in here. I don't know, I don't want this video to be too long. Maybe I'll break it up into a two-part series depending on how much stuff I get in here. So. I'm super excited. I made the nice list. Okay, so in this box, you will see paper. A bunch of paper. So, yeah, this is gonna be a problem. Oh boy. Ooh, I see a bunch of plushies already. Paper, 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 bunch of paper. And then there is a piece. A paper in here and it's an envelope so I don't want to open it just yet I think that might be the extra stuff that I want so I would give you values on these items but I honestly have no idea I've checked out their website maybe once or twice out of curiosity as well as being interested in their BFF series but other than that I haven't actually looked up prices of anything or know of a certain like price point so I'm going to pull out this one because the other one that I was pulling out was not coming out. So this is a Crayola Kid Robot Critters Plush series. So it's a super cute dragon. Okay, I'm going to open him. I love dragons. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Super cute. And he has like a Crayola attached to him. I know they came out with figurines 
that held actual like real crayons like it actually came with a crayon related to the color of the creatures so this is um shamrock i think that's what his name is because that's the color um name on the crayola and here he is he's super cute and he's full of beans so i think that will help him like stand up so i'm definitely going to have to probably display him on my shelf but it depends on how many more funko pops that i get so yeah oh my gosh this is like super super good quality and if you didn't know because you're probably just joining my channel for the first time or haven't seen my other videos that have to do with plushies i love collecting plushies so this is perfect for my collection yay oh my gosh i'm super excited oh yeah that was covering other stuff underneath there okay this video might be long so i'm gonna pull out this big thing so it is another plushie and it's um i want to say it's slimer huggable try me shake action um Hug me instructions. Remove battery tab to activate hugging power. Hug me and I'll shake. You can clap your hands to get me shaking. So yeah, I want to say, oh, this is Slimer Wolves. Yeah. So it's a hug me Slimer. I'm going to open him. So honestly, I have not watched Ghostbusters. Or maybe I have when I was little. I never watched Ghostbusters. But again, I love um, plushies. And you can't really see him right now, but I do have... Um, the Stay Puff Marshmallow Dude that I won from round one in, a, in one of their claw machines. So yeah, so I'm I'm interested, or I like their, their characters. I just haven't watched them before. Ooh, okay, he's vibrating. Oh, can you hear that? It's so funny. <laughs> Okay, so when you hug him, he vibrates. Can you hear that? Can you hear that? It's so weird. And you can clap your hands. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh, I'm so excited. I love this box. Okay, I'm going to turn him off because I'm not sure if the set... Oh gosh. Yeah. Nope. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's so cute. Okay, I'm gonna just toss him to my boyfriend. He's actually over there in the corner. Okay. So, um, here's another plushie. So I guess I'm opening all the plushies right now. And this looks like a cashew? I don't know. Cash pistache. So it's a pistachio? Oh yeah, why did I say cashew? It's a pistachio. Cash is nutty. This off-the-wall nut is always keeping the residents of the palace on their plates. He is always doing the unexpected. He is a ringleader of party planning and special events. So his name is Cash. I don't know. I guess because I saw the that he's brown. I don't know. For me, cashews are green. No, not cashews. Pistachio nuts. Pistachio nuts are green. So yeah, super cute. I don't know, it reminds me of fortune cookie, you know, when you're like opening it, cracking it. I'm so excited. I don't know, there's more stuff in this box than I thought there would be. Um, here is a pin. Sorry, I'm like struggling. Box is in the way. Um, so it says NYCC 2017. So if you can tell, it is a rabbit sitting in a car that looks like um, taxi colors. So that is pretty cool. I do collect pins too. I like collecting pins from Disney especially, but I've kind of laid off because as you can tell, I am now investing in Funko Pops, even over there and there. Then we'll open this. So it looks like it is a t-shirt. It is a small. It's okay. I, I, I do fit a small. And I think this might be unisex. So, ooh, this is pretty cool. So it is a labbit and it's in blood splatter. So that's pretty cool. I actually like horror. I don't know if you guys knew that, but I love Disney, but I also love horror. Yeah, it's a, it's a weird combo. Um, then, oh, these are so cute. 
These are Happy Labbit ornaments. Um, there you go. I'm not going to take them out of the box. But um, this one looks like he's getting like um, super crazy with hot chocolate. This one um, has a green Santa hat and a green mustache. This one has... Um, he looks like a snowman. This one is... I don't know. He has a Santa hat and a mustache. And the last one, I don't know. I don't know what he's supposed to be, but he reminds me of Crumpus. Oh, there you go. I am so smart. Here, here's a better view of them, so I don't have to take them out of the box. Yay, cute. I love Christmas ornaments. And I do have like a tiny tree at work now that I put up, and it's Nightmare for Christmas related because I love the Nightmare for Christmas. If you haven't noticed, there is two shelves of Nightmare for Christmas pops. So I have a Create Your Own Superhero Toy, which included two sticker art packs. So it says sticker art, it's Marvel, and it's Spider-Man, which is perfect because my boyfriend loves Spider-Man. So that's cool. I do have um, a do-it-yourself kind of model like this. That's just like um, a regular model that you can work with. And um, I'm excited to actually paint that one. So it's cool that I have this one too, so I can work on that with my boyfriend. And this will be easier for him to deal with because um, I'm more artistic than he is. And he has trouble. <laughs> He's looking at me now. I just threw him under the bus. <laughs> um, I don't know what else to show. Or what next to show. So this is from Futurama. I actually watched a lot of Futurama. I'm not sure if they're coming out with... Um, more episodes, or they're still coming out with new episodes, but I don't know. It says, All Glory to the Hypnotoad. So this is, I'm assuming, a figurine of the Hypnotoad. <gasps> that is so freaking cool! Okay. I'm gonna definitely take him out of the box. Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, and look at his eyes! He's like hypnotizing you. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, there you go. Okay. See? Do you see his eyes? Do you see his eyes? The camera's not that good, but yeah, you can kind of see his eyes. So yeah, this is the Hypnotoad. That is so freaking cool. That is awesome. Okay, I'm gonna have to figure out where to put all these figurines now. This is so freaking cool. Oh my gosh, I wish like I was able to get another like mystery box from them. I hope they come out with more mystery boxes because I love I love mystery boxes and I just love all their stuff that they have put into this box. So this is a kid robot uh, mystery box. I don't know what figurine is in here, but in the back it says it ought to be solemnized with pomp and parade with shrews, games, sports, guns. Bells, bonfires, and illuminations from one end of the continent to the other from the time forward forevermore. Um, by John Adams. Uh, it says, Celebrating Indie Spirit. So, I don't know what exactly is in here. But I'm assuming it is a figurine? I don't know. Actually, I think I'm going to be able to squeeze everything into this one video. I'm going pretty fast because I'm too excited. Yeah. Uh, oh, this is cool. Oh, okay, so I guess what was shown on the box is exactly what I got. So it's like the bald eagle, and then there's stars. There's like a pyramid with an all-seeing eye on it. Backside has star, Ferris wheel, side view. Wait, I think I saw something on the ears. So it says... 0407. I don't really know what that means. Comment down below if you know what this figure means or what it's about. Not too sure. Maybe, no, actually 4th of July. Oh, okay, I get it. I'm just kidding. I'm stupid. My boyfriend just like <laughs> motioned to me 4th of July. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> I'm dumb. Don't listen to me. I don't know. So here is another mystery box. It says Holiday Party Dunny. And then I like 
the design of the box. It says, tis the season to party. So I don't know, again, what's going to be in here, but it's probably going to be a dunny. Oh, gosh. They hate these things so well. And then, tinkly. <gasps> Cute! Oh my gosh, that's so freaking cool! Okay. So yeah, here is the Dunny that I got. And he's see-through. And like, you can shake him, so he's kind of like a snow globe. Oh no, his arm is... Oh, actually I think... Oh! Never mind. I thought it was broken. His arms do move. So, it's really whitewashed, but there's like a little bunny right here. And then there's like little fireworks. So yeah, super cute. And he has like a little fuzzy hat that you can put on, I think, either of his ears because it actually pops up. So cute! Is he shown on the box? No, he's not shown on the box. Then here is another mystery box. That is not focusing. Um, this says Justice League. Sorry, my, my camera's showing me the text backwards. So yeah, it's Justice League. Here are the little figures that you can get. Oh my gosh, camera's not focusing. So you can get Batman, Superman, Wonder Woman, Flash, Green Lantern, Cyborg, Aquaman, Classic Batman, Blue Beetle, Animal Man, Booster Gold, um, Zatanna, Green Arrow, and Guy Gardner. Ooh, sorry, my camera's like focusing wherever. Um, I really like Batman. I'm not a big Justice League fan, but I think I would be. Oh, actually, I would love to get. Yeah, love to get Batman. I would be fine with Superman or Wonder Woman as well. Got Batman. <laughs> um, and his keychain is stuck in the plastic. Ooh. Oh no. Oh no. Yeah, that's like taped on real good. Okay. Yep, I have garbage all over the place. So he was. 3 out of 24. So he is a common. Because this is just the regular Batman. Sorry. Focus. Yeah. He's super cute. Yay, I'm glad I got Batman. Oh, my foot falling asleep. Okay. Everything's falling down. <laughs> then here is another mystery box. And it's Kibbles and Labbits. So I'm assuming these are going to be dogs. And I love dogs, even though I'm actually considering getting a cat soon. But we'll, we shall see. And it's not focusing. Okay, it's really not focusing. Do not focus on my face. Um, so you can get a Dalmatian, St. Bernard, Sheepdog, Shibu Inu, Pug, Poodle, Australian Shepherd, um, a Dutchard, Dutchard, Dutcham, Dutcham, I don't know. Corgi, Bulldog, Boston Terrier, Bernice, Mountain Dog, Beagle, and then there's a mystery one. So I really want the Pug, but I would be fine with the Shiba Inu, Corgi, Bulldog. You know what? I'd be fine with any of them. But it'd be cool getting the super mystery one. And we got the Beagle. A beagle? Yes, this is a beagle and he is 4 out of 40. Super cute! Super cute! <laughs> I like his little butthole. <laughs> and his tongue is sticking out. Cute! And then the last item in this box is this big box. And I'm assuming it might be another figurine. So this is the Labbit Classic, and it says 10 inches, so 
yeah, I'm assuming this might be a figurine. Oh my gosh, I have so many figurines now. I don't know when I'm going to do it myself. Yeah, that's it for the box. Well, I have the envelope still to open. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Cute! <laughs> I'm making so much noise. Oh gosh, okay. So it's like super taped on there. It's taped shut. Okay, sorry guys. It's taking a little bit longer. Okay. But yeah. So, oh my gosh, he's super cute. So I get a lab it. He's black. He has a big brown mustache. He's looking up. And he's super shiny. And he has a little butthole. Look at that. <laughs> my boyfriend thinks I'm crazy. Oh yeah, and it says Kid Robot on the bottom. Not too sure if you can see it because it's super shiny. But yeah. It's a... Good heavy, heavy figure. Yay! Okay. I'll close him up so he doesn't get damaged. Okay. So, yeah, that's all the stuff that I got from the box. So now I'm gonna open this envelope. So I'm wondering how many boxes are actually part of the nice list. So it says, tis the season to party, happy whatever, hope the party never stops. Oh, okay. So it's just like, um, it's just a letter. Yeah, I should have opened that first. But yeah, so that's pretty much it for my box. But, um... That was actually pretty fun. I really liked everything that I got in the box. Um, I think the one that I liked most was this little dragon guy. But I also liked Slimer too. And yeah, I really loved everything in the box. So comment down below if you also invested in this kid robot box. And I really hope that you got a bunch of stuff that you really liked in the box as well. So... If you like this video, make sure you click the like button. Also, make sure that you subscribe to my channel. And I'll link um, my different social media accounts in the description below as well. And I'll link um, Kid Robot's um, website too, so you can actually look into what they have to offer on their website. And last but not least, I hope you have an amazing day. Bye!